Vi har TV, Gary Lee Jennings Jim, Dave Jennings, Riley Roy, Scott Fitzgerald, Mike Jeffers, and Mike Jennings. How are you doing, lads? Fine, man. How are you? Yeah, good. Sick. Well, you've been busy all over Christmas. No rest for you, what? Yeah, we've been in. We've been all over Christmas. Actually, we started Christmas Day mm -hmm. off. We well, got uh, boxing there. I think it was. Now we're in boxing no, there. No, Christmas Day, Christmas Eve, and boxing there. Because mm -hmm. uh, obviously Jack's fighting and Mark's fighting on the twenty-first of January at Preston Bulldog. Yes, well, we sort of come down to talk to you because Mark. Yeah, so when is it? Twenty-first. Yeah. TV show as well. Yeah, ITV four. The first one for a long time. And a bit of a grudge match. Yeah, obviously with Mick Hall, you know, Mick's claim to fame that he went and he, he thought he got robbed off Jack in a free round and a prize fight or so. Was that the last prize fight as well, wasn't yeah, it? I don't think he's been more since, has Yeah, so obviously Jack wants to put things right. 2015, that wasn't it? Yeah, Valentine's Day, 2015, was it? Yeah. He's only had a couple of fights and he's not really been active. Well, Jack's been very active. Yeah, he's had six, he's had six fights, Jack, since Mick's two, and he's uh, He's had two 12 round fights as well. One for the British title. One for the British against Nick Blackwell and obviously the win against John Ryder um, on the Anthony Crawler bill. And, so. and then at the end of the year, you had Matty Askins uh, winning his final eliminator. Yeah. And you could, at some point this month, you're going to find out when this, <coughs> he wins the prize for, uh, the yeah. purse for um, holding that fight. I think it's the uh, 11th, goes up for purse bid, so hopefully. We'll find out when and when it's going to take place and where. And that'll be against Craig Kennedy. Craig Kennedy, yeah. For the British title. Yeah. So it could be a cracking year for you, Jim, as yeah. it was last year. End of the day, we all, we put the time in and the lads put the time in. So you know, and they're all talented kids. So it's just a matter of getting things right, practicing things, and if they listen to what we say, I think they'll all go on. All of them, what we've mentioned, will go on and do well. Well, Scott, you're doing. You're going to be headlining your your own show up in Preston. Well, yeah, yeah, having a first time on the floor in, in Preston for years. I didn't get a chance boxing with the GB team, and then I've been boxing on a lot of matchroom shows as a pro. So yeah, it's going to be good. It's going to new owner at the Guildhall. You know, it's trying to bring it back to life and going to put a show it's on. Great venue, though, that like Guildhall, wasn't it? Yeah, it's best yeah, venue. Yeah, yeah. Uh, long way. It's going to be an after party there as well. So it's. No, it's going to be a good night. When's that going to be? Is that the 11th that's, of March? That's uh, 11th of March, yeah, that's nine weeks Saturday, so I'm on a uh, starting my hard training now. Yeah, you, like you say, you've been ticking over as well, letting yourself blow up in between, have you? Um, no, I've, I've not been too bad, you know, I've stayed in the gym you know, the whole, right through Christmas with these two, obviously training hard for this fight, you know, I've been in as well, so enjoying Christmas a bit more. But, than them too maybe, but yeah, I've stuck at it, so I'm ready to, ready to go with the hard stuff now. Well, like I say, 2016 was a great year, unbeaten uh, professional fighters, and uh, this year you've got some titles to go for. Yeah, I mean, last year we were unbeaten in 16, like you just said, uh, 15 with our lads, and one included Robin Deacon. Was that his first win as well? Then? That was his first win in 55, <laughs> yeah, in 55. What, how did that come about? How come he come I've known Robin, I've known Robin for a long time as a mate of mine and he just said, can I come up and do a bit of training up here with you guys? So he said, yeah, and he came up and... He's a character, isn't he? Yeah, he's a character, all right. But yeah, he got the win, you know, for a play to him. Uh, but yeah, as I was saying, we, you know, a couple of them fights last year, we wasn't the favourites to win them all, obviously. No, definitely. Jack Arnfield, John Ryder. Jack was a massive underdog there, and you know, he got the win, he, bo he boxed to a good game plan next year, he deserved the win, and then Matty Askin against Tommy McCarthy, and people mm -hmm. had Matty as an underdog in that fight, and again, he, Matty boxed to his plan, and he stuck Fair, to it, yeah, he Fair boxed win. to it, you know, he, he stayed disciplined in what he had to do in the ring, and, and it paid off for him, and he got the win, so hopefully this coming year now, we'll, you know, we're going to get paid, paid back to what they've done in definitely, 2016, definitely. Matty for the British title against Craig Kennedy. Which you've got another couple bits. of pros started down here, Ben uh, yeah, Swarbrick, Swarbrick, he turned over with you. And yeah. As well as it was your first year as a yeah, pro, Mark. wasn't it? My first year as a pro as well. Was it? I uh, thought yeah. you'd February's not been a year since then. Uh, oh, was it not, mate? No. Oh, right. Is it right? Right? Yeah, five, five. five. I would have liked to have had maybe six, but five, you know. Get, get get this uh, one in March and then I've got one in April as well, the Echo I think, so that'll be seven then. Yeah, because you've been fighting on a lot of the uh, major TV shows, haven't you? Yeah, been on a lot of big bills, we've been on that fight before the main event a few times, it's been some good experience, but, you know, um, 
get on with it now. See so. the best deal this year, won't we? Yeah, yeah. definitely. Yeah, yeah. I've, uh, can do things a lot yeah, better. Good learning year for you. Then. Good learning year. I just think I can do things better uh, outside the gym. My last fight were a kick up the arse, so <laughs> make sure I put that right. Be working harder than ever now. Be the best version of me next time. Mm -hmm. And and Mark, I mean, like say three fights. Well, you didn't turn over until middle of the year, was it? May. Yeah, May. Yeah, yeah. So. Yeah. Been a nice busy year for you, and hopefully we busier 2017, and not even 19 yet. <laughs> nah, yeah. got a good win in a couple of weeks, and then just, um, just keep, keep improving in the gym. No, we don't need to rush. You wouldn't think you were only 18, no, not no. long term 18 as well. Well, last time out was it Kieran uh, Gray, was it? Kieran Gray, yeah. yeah. And I think he's what? Nearly 30 years old. Twice older than you, 38. Yeah, he's twice older than that. Is he? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. And uh, he couldn't believe it, he couldn't when he came into the changing rooms afterwards, chatting to you, and he found out you were 18. He was like. <laughs> but yeah. it is, it bodes for a good future for him and for yourself, Scott, because I mean, yeah. what are you now? 24 now, you mate? Just turned 25. Yeah, I'm so getting old. old. <laughs> Well, I need to, yeah. Hopefully, get this year out of the way, keep winning the a way. A good year, are. and then, uh, you know, hopefully a big fight end of this year, and, uh, and then a big 2018. And you've only been, what, how long have you been in this place now, then? Right. About three years? years. Uh, four years in oh. October, just gone. Yeah, and you've got a good years. amateur side running in here? Yeah, I've got 20 plus kids amateur. They're doing well, you know. Well, and, uh, well, I come down and video one of your shows. Uh, yeah, like yeah, I see it, didn't I? Yeah. It's a cracking show. Cracking venue as well. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Part part, yeah. Where the old used to be the hit man in here, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> well, well no, we started off with Matty and then obviously we've accumulated a few more professionals as we've gone along, but yeah, Matty was the first lad to come down. Because you trained with him down at your old gym at Moss and Collier, wouldn't you? Yeah, me and Matty used to train. Well, I used to take Matty up there mm. he, at the time. I don't think he could drive, I can't remember why. I used to take him up on trolley and bring him back sort of thing but... Well we all forget, he's been around a long time hasn't he? Yeah. Well he's yeah. really, he's yeah, old he's going to be as People think Matt is older Yeah, he's not as old as he thinks, or is he just turned 28? Yeah, he's yeah. just turned 28 sort of thing. And, and for a cruise away, it's nothing young, like it. Matt is, not only is Matt is good technically, but what we've found lately, what, what we're more excited about with Matty is his attitude towards mm -hmm. the game and his attitude in the changing rooms and stuff like that, where at one time you know, it would have been having the nerves. Well, now it's, everything's a lot more positive, and I think this 2017, I think it'll be a big year for Matter. Yeah. Yeah. I think if he can win this British title, which I think he's got a good chance of doing, yeah. then that will put him right on the world team, which is where he wants to be, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's and it's, I mean, it's a Lonsdale belt. It is a major title. I know it's not a world title, but it's, it's, great it's, title, it's the best, it? you know. It's, it's, if you're from England or Britain, that's well, the one that you doubt. want, you know, and I think that will give Matty a massive confidence boost, you know, and he'll. Obviously, it'll make him a bit wealthier as well, which will make things easier for him. Cool. He's always struggling. Did you, know did you win your British title outright? No, I got robbed off young people. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I thought you had done well, you know. Because it's a lovely belt, isn't it? I was, yeah. Uh, yeah, I was with Gary Sanchez. Nice nicest looking belt in the world, I yeah, think. It well, it's, a, it's, it's the original nice, as well. Yeah, it's not a nice it? looking belt. No. Yeah. Well, listen, hopefully, like I say, there should be a couple of them in this gym by next time I come down here. So. Uh, yeah. Good luck for everything. I'll see you hopefully on the night, on the 21st when you fight at Preston. And uh, like you say, you're headlining as well, one yeah. of our shows, VIPs, up on March 11th. Yeah, yeah. March on that as well. All oh, going well in this fight. Right. Yeah. Keeping it busy then? Yeah, yeah. All right, lads, it's been a pleasure. Cheers, Cheers mate. Cheers, mate. Bye, 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 Cheers, mate.